Free money? Sounds too good to be true? Well, it's possible through cryptocurrencies and airdrops. And if you're asking yourself, what is an airdrop? It's basically a giveaway of free tokens, usually at the beginning stages of a cryptocurrency. And if you're new to this whole subject, subject of blockchains, ICOs, or cryptocurrencies in general, consider subscribing to the channel because every Thursday we have our Tactic Thursday where we give you expert and also basic information about cryptocurrencies in general. Now you might be asking yourself, why does a cryptocurrency company give away free coins to begin with? And the answer is pretty simple. Basically, there's over 1,500 cryptocurrency companies on, listed on CoinMarketCap.com. But the truth is, we really just pay attention to the ones we have in our portfolio. And through the airdrop, now the cryptocurrency company found a way to sneak into our portfolio and we will start paying attention to it. We will look at the website, we'll see what their project is about, maybe send a coin around, look at the way it works. And then if you like it, we will buy the coin and maybe even refer our friends. So there are two different ways an airdrop works. The first one is an unannounced airdrop like it was the case with Omisigo. And everybody who was holding Ethereum during the time of the snapshot of the airdrop would receive 0.075 Omisigos in return. In the second scenario, it's an announced airdrop like it was the case with Next and Ignis. Everybody who was holding Next on December 25th would get Ignis in return. And that drove up the price from Next actually from 40 cents up to $2, but after the snapshot, it dropped tremendously back to 40 cents again. So definitely keep an eye out for that. Another way to earn free coins are what's so-called faucets. There you have to perform a small task and in return you get a small amount of free cryptocurrencies as well. The task can be anything from following a social media account, visiting a blog post or a website, to registering somewhere and giving your email. Also, when you perform an airdrop, there are certain things you should consider. And the first one is that you should have the private key to your funds. Because if your funds are in exchange, you don't have the private key. And now you're dependent on the cryptocurrency exchange to support the airdrop. And if you're not, they're not supporting the airdrop, you're not going to get your free tokens as well. Second thing, very important, use a secondary email address. So don't use an email where you registered on any other cryptocurrency exchange. There have been some people who have been hacked that way. Third one is never ever give out your private key. I think this should be obvious, but I definitely want to uh, tell you that anybody who asks for that, that just screams, it's a scam. The fourth one is, if you have any question, check the Telegram group, pin message, usually, usually there's an exp explanation what you should do. And if not, ask the question, there's some people there who will assist you. So now you guys know what an airdrop is, how it works, and how you guys can get free money in cryptocurrency. And advice from me, don't expect too much. Basically, there's a saying in marketing is that if you don't pay for a product, you're probably the product. So the airdrops are a way for a cryptocurrency company to promote their cryptocurrency to you so you end up buying it. At the same time, it's also an opportunity for you to get the coin at a very low price. For an example, Stellar Lumens got out their airdrop at less than a cent and it peaked at 92 cents. So it's also a good way to make a little bit of money and you never know where the coin ends up. But like you see, blockchain, ICOs, cryptocurrencies are such a broad topic and also so new to most of the people. So that's why we created this channel, ICO Insider. Every Thursday, we have our Tactic Thursdays with basic and expert knowledge on cryptocurrencies. If you like it, consider subscribing and I'll see you in the next video.